tonight, ladies and gentlemen, that we have in store for you tonight. I'm Michael Cole, alongside the Hall of Famer, Jerry the King Lawler. And you know, Michael, I've been looking forward to this night for a very long time. Let's get it on. I am so ready for this match, Michael. This is going to be good. They're struggling for control right now. Oh, struggle is right, Cole. This is really back and forth. So what do you think about Big E? With this type of brute strength and vicious mean streak, Langston is one of the most feared men in WWE. Championship on the line. Oh, you're right about that. Let's get this thing going. Who's gonna be the champion? Just look at this man. He's all business. And that's the way he has to be if he wants to win here tonight. There was no bigger announcement in the spring of 2000 than when The Undertaker returned from the dead. As the American badass, Undertaker took aim at a host of adversaries he was looking to pummel. Undertaker brought all hell with him in his battles with the likes of DX, the McMahon family, Nature Boy Ric Flair, and many others. I can't believe this is the no disqualification match. We could see anything in this one. Could see anything. We will see anything. Anything and everything. Oh, that's going to put an end to this one. Oh, this isn't good. And these superstars will do whatever it takes to win here tonight. When you're such a prolific striker like The Undertaker, you can create your own momentum. When you're as dominant as The Undertaker, you can unleash the flames of hell at your choosing. When we speak about The Undertaker and his battles as the American badass, one of the most grueling we're reminded of is his conflict with Triple H at WrestleMania 17. Here we go, back inside the ring. What do you mean we? We're still outside the ring, Cole. It's them, they're inside the ring. Slam. Ain't gonna be long now. <laughs> right, his minutes are numbered. And he escapes with a kick out. Big E is still in the game. Oh, the American badass didn't just beat the hell out of people. He added some WWE gold to his collection, too. He was a co-holder of the World Tag Team Championship, a hardcore champion, and the WWE champion. Oh, my gosh! Undertaker's taking him for the last ride. Won't be long now. Nobody comes back from The Undertaker's last ride. Whoa. For a moment there, it looked like it was the end of the road for Big E. Oh, man, what a move by Undertaker. The dead man's power is simply supernatural. Sometimes the best offense is a great defense, and that's exactly what we're seeing here. Big E came to WWE from the worlds of NCAA Division I football and powerlifting. After barreling through the competition in NXT, Big E proved immediately he was going to be a major player when he debuted on Raw as the enforcer for Dolph Ziggler. You know, Michael, Big E certainly made quite the debut on Raw in 2012. It wasn't too long afterwards, Big E won the coveted Intercontinental Championship and continued to mow down anyone that stood in his way. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. He is slowly getting dissected. The Undertaker. Richard Slam. Ain't gonna be long now. <laughs> right, his minutes are numbered. Uh, the kick out's on and saving this match goes on. You know, it's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in his tank. Jerry the King Law. In a relatively brief period of time, Big E has accomplished a great deal. His in-ring WWE debut came at WrestleMania 29, and E quickly became recognized as one of the most powerful intercontinental champions after that. Impressive, to say the least. Left. You're right, this guy 
that's still near 100%. That's the power of The Undertaker right there. Looking to take the shoulder and arm out of the equation here. Look at him, Michael. I mean, those moves have really started to add up. Cole, it can't be debated. Big E has had a remarkable career in a short amount of time. To go from a bodyguard to your debut match taking place at a WrestleMania and then to win the Intercontinental Championship, a title with so much history, it's amazing. You can get every superstar on the roster is crowded around the mind and recovers. And the shoulder's up now. That's a kick out. Nice. It looks like there's more gas in Big E's tank tonight. And it's apparent that Big E has been injured. Detroit has had the reputation for being an electric crowd. The fans here in attendance tonight are indeed no different. Ladies and gentlemen, when we start looking at the moves of Big E, that's when I'm reminded how much I appreciate the opportunity to talk about them as opposed to feeling... The shoulders are down! And it's up. He got the shoulder up. Oh, Undertaker! He can't believe that almost happened! Getting his attention with a vicious strike. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. So damaging. He is just getting busted up. Whoa! It may be time! Chuck slam! Oh. The Undertaker is going to put him in the grave right here. The Undertaker is going to have his opponent resting in peace. The winner and new champion. You want to talk about incredible high-impact sports entertainment? Check out what happened during this match. Let's go to the highlights here. Let's see what happened during that incredible matchup. I can't believe what we saw during this one.